guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hey, I'm Amanda and you should probably hit that subscribe button down below. It's free and I would really, really appreciate it. So, your girl has a pretty epic haul in store for you today. <laughs> but before we get into that, I am so stinking proud of myself. These nails, are the most fire, amazing set of nails I have done. I hope the lighting doesn't like wash it out. They look so amazing in like natural light and the sunlight, they just like glisten and glimmer. Oh, I will insert a clip so you guys can see they are beautiful. If you guys want any tutorials on nail anything let me know down below because oh my gosh I can get so freaking creative why not learn how to do something that makes you feel so sexy and confident all on your own right <laughs> anyways guys why don't we jump in to this freaking haul at Lush and it's been a while guys but I went to Urban Planet they were well, when are they not having a deal? But I happened to be at the mall, which as most of you guys know by now, I moved like away from the city. So I don't have any malls around me. Like the closest shopping center I have is like 25 plus minutes away. And that's not a mall, it's a shopping center. So anyways, I think I'm gonna start out with Lush first. So I feel like I did grab quite a few things. So the first thing I grabbed is this nifty, adorable little like yellow cone. Oh, it smells so good. It's like tropical with a little tiny bit of citrus in it. I don't know how to explain it. It's freaking awesome. And this is actually like a shower bath bomb or I guess a shower bomb. So she explained it to me. You set it in your hands like this and you let the water run on it and it like puffs up like freaking shave cream or something and that's what you use to wash your body. And so I'm really excited to try that. Then the next bag, oh this is what I was really excited for. This here, it looks like, I don't know, maybe a ladybug or something. This is a nourishing body exfoliating bar. Oh my gosh, so once the top layer of the body moisturizer like, you know, gets worn off, those stripes in there are actually little exfoliator pieces. So you use it like this on your body and it exfoliates as well as moisturizes, which is pretty awesome. So moving on to the next purchase from Lush is a glitter rocket ship bath bomb. When I seen this, I thought it was so freaking cute. Oh, and it smells so sweet and so fruity and right up my alley. And of course there is shimmer and glitter all over it and all through it. And it is blue and yellow. Nothing really fancy inside it or anything. It just smells amazing. And I have been loving bath bomb baths, especially in my jacuzzi bathtub, which I feel so freaking blessed to have. The next blush purchase is another bath bomb, but it's just a normal round bath bomb. Whew, very, very citrusy. This one does have those like confetti in there, she said, which is really cool. But she also mentioned that that was really good for your skin too. So the uh, next one, I thought this was so freaking adorable. And then when I found out what it was exactly, I loved it even more. So it's this here. It's in the shape of a flower, but it's got a little stick through it. So she said that you hold it by that little stick and you run this under your bath water so it spins like that. And this is a bubble bar. How freaking cute is that? So I had to pick it up. But oh my gosh, I wonder if the bubbles are gonna be pink and everything. Ah! 
That would be the perfect bath for me. And why not be sitting in a bath full of pink water, pink bubbles, and pink glitter, right? <laughs> so the last Lush purchase is an oil bath bomb. So she said I could split this in half because if you look really close, you can kind of see that it's just been like two pieces like pushed together and it's a little star and she said I could stick this into my bath water and then this just adds like moisturizers and like bath oils to the bath which I thought was really freaking cute and I did get a bunch of samples because I want to try some new kind of natural skincare especially moisturizers and body exfoliators because your girl is dry. I don't know if you caught my last video, but it was a my favorite dry skincare products. I'll leave that link down below so you can check it out. Because your girl has dry ass skin, okay? So let's jump in to the Urban Planet bag. Um, I'm gonna start out with the jewelry pieces first just to get them out of the way. Okay, I think these are so freaking sexy. It's like a choker and a body chain like attached into one. So if you see, there's like one clasp, but oh, I picture a woman wearing it with like a super low cut top. So you can see the rhinestone chain like in between her boobs. I know it's a little bit un practical for a woman who doesn't necessarily have like nice big fake boobs but if you're confident and you know how to rock your boobies in a very low cut shirt i'm gonna do it and i think i can do it proper and still be a classy ass bitch <laughs> then the next jewelry piece i found oh my gosh i was so surprised to have found it at urban planet and that is this necklace oh my gosh it's like the big fat ghetto gold chain with a big fat blinged out key on it oh like this is the type of shit oh hello <laughs> this is the kind of shit that i would search for on aliexpress for hours looking for i've done an aliexpress haul i can leave it linked down below but that was done like a little while ago i love anything big gaudy and ghetto <laughs> Okay, so first I picked up a few pairs of jeans because I have been, and it was at that moment when she realized she completely failed. <laughs> no, but seriously guys, I just realized when I looked down at the pants that they were too big. Oh my God. <laughs> So I think I'm just gonna cut the whole pants part right out of the video. Anyways guys, back to the haul. Then I picked up this, I call it like a Fashion Nova shirt because you can buy millions of these types of shirts from Fashion Nova, but I tried it on and oh my gosh, it was so stinking flattering. And it's just this black caught me, but it's like ribbed material, long sleeve, so freaking cute but you can cinch the front so you can have it like shorter by your belly button but longer on the sides super cute and everything other than the jeans was 40 percent off so this shirt was regular 19.99 and i'll have the prices that i paid in the corner there like usual so the next thing i got oh my gosh i tried on See, a lot of times when I go to Urban Planet because things are so cheap, a lot of the time I don't even bother trying it on. I just like look and I do like the up to your body thing and I'm like, okay, that's good. Oh, that's not bad. <laughs> so this time I actually like took the time, went into the change rooms and tried things on. And you know what? I would have bought probably double this amount but because I actually went into the change room to try everything on, I actually ended up saving more money. So anyways, back to the haul. They had a whole bunch of these like crop windbreaker jackets. Oh, I wish I could have got a whole bunch of these, but a lot of times when I find something that I really, really like and I'm looking on the rack, there's only like small and extra smalls left. And like, I'm sorry, but your girl is not 
squeezing her sausagey body into a small or extra small. <laughs> so unfortunately, these were pretty overpicked, which makes me really sad. And I think stores, if you're always having a whole ton of small and extra small and double zero to size three left over, like why don't you, you know, cut out some of those super small sizes and add some more of the like mediums, large, extra large, double XL. Then shopping would be way more inclusive and like all different size guys and girls would be able to go shopping more frequently in stores like that. And then we would all be able to take advantage of the super low prices, right? God, I think sometimes I should be like president of the world because I feel like I'm the only one who thinks properly. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, this is super cute. It's white, crappie, it's got two pockets and all of the accents on it are silver and there is a drawstring on the bottom so you can like have it as a tight crop or you can loosen it and have it as like a looser kind of crop jacket. Oh, this is so freaking cute. And this was $39.99, but I know that's a little bit expensive, but it is better quality than some things that are at Urban Planet. <laughs> then, oh my gosh, this last thing that I got. Oh, okay. I have been obsessed with like, the baggy sweater with like oh thigh high boots i absolutely love that look so when i seen this sweater oh, i oh, i ran i ran right to it this was the first thing i picked up you're like just show us already god amanda <laughs> and it's this white oversized sweater with a fluorescent and black queen on it and i did of course get it in extra large because i wanted it to be oversized and long enough to be able to wear it like that with the thigh high boots isn't that adorable it's like so simple but yet says a whole lot because your girl likes to at least think she's a queen you know what i'm a queen in my own home <laughs> we'll keep it at that that makes more sense and this gorgeous sweater was regular $29.99 and the fit of this is so perfect i cannot wait to wear this but when i do wear it i have to be so so freaking careful because it is white and i can sometimes destroy white <laughs> Well, what do you want? I spray tan, I wear makeup, I actually do things, you know? So it's pretty easy to get dirty or get a little mark or get your foundation on this collar. You know how it goes, I'm sure. <laughs> well, guys, that wraps up this mall haul. I was so excited to do this haul because I haven't been shopping in a while. Your girl is like seriously country life out here. <laughs> I did also go to the dollar store and I did pick up a few things for a few upcoming videos. I'm really excited for it. I hope you guys enjoy them. So definitely keep your eyes peeled for that. And if you haven't joined the fam bam, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button down below. It's free. And we can't really say that about a lot of things nowadays, can we? Like, no strings attached. I promise. <laughs> and don't forget to follow me on all my social medias. Those are also linked down below. Thank you so much for watching and hanging out with me today. I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.